y'all. Today we are going to talk about some diet tips uh, that are sort of um, kind of applicable to right now as we're coming into the holiday time. So the first one I wanted to talk to you about is a friend of mine who has been kind of having a little struggle to lose her last sort of 10-ish 10, 10 pounds of baby weight. And I saw her the other day and she was drinking a, I don't know, one of those Starbucks drinks, some Frappuccino thing or whatever lamenting the fact that she was having trouble losing weight. And I said, have you looked at the nutrition count in the drink you're drinking? And she was thinking, well, yeah, you know, it's more than a coffee, but you know, it's a coffee drink and everybody's drinking them. And she just had, she wanted it so badly that she was sort of turning a blind eye to how incredibly caloric they were. So I went online and the Grande, which is the 16 ounce. Um, so I just picked like the caramel Frappuccino. It's 430 calories. So, you're talking about running for four miles. So like 40 to 45 minutes of running in order to burn off that one drink. So you're not doing yourself any favors. If it's your big old treat for the week, that's totally different, but don't make it your good daily driver in terms of your coffee drink if you don't want the sneaky calories in there. So then that led me to um, another little story I was thinking about. One of my old producers when I had my TV show in Dallas would put so much half and half in her coffee in the morning. And she was sort of, again, lamenting the fact that she was having trouble just losing the last few pounds and it was just so stubborn and she was having such a hard time. But she would go glug, 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 glug and put, and she must've been putting half a cup of, of half and half into her coffee, right? Well, so I would, this is what I showed her and I'm gonna show you guys. So a serving size of half and half is two tablespoons. That's 40 calories. So let me show you, I'm gonna show you in this clear glass what that looks like. So that's not much. That is actually a little bit over because I splashed it in and I was a little sloppy. All right, so that's two tablespoons of half and half right there. By comparison, let me show you what a cup of well, I'm using oat milk in this case. Hang on. All right, so let me show you what a cup looks like by comparison. I'm just using an oat, an oat milk. Um, this isn't even a cup because I couldn't even find my cup measure and I'm running out of oat milk. So this is three quarters of a cup. So this isn't even the full amount. All right, by comparison. This little tiny amount, Half and half, two tablespoons. Actually, a little bit more than two tablespoons. This is a little under a cup. So, I like oat milk. Actually, this one is this one is the Trader Joe's they just started coming out with. It's okay. I write, I like Oatly better. The one in the blue carton, the full fat Oatly. It's not even that much fat. This one's okay. One day we'll do it. We'll do a little taste test on oat milks one of these days. Anyway, so what you need to do if you like your half and half, and that's fine measure it get out your measuring spoon and measure two tablespoons into your coffee and see what color it makes it and how it makes it taste because if you're loading tons of half and half you're talking about hundreds of calories before you even get your day started so you're already like way over for what you're probably going to need to have by that time in the morning other one was somebody it was my brother or somebody was um drinking those naked smoothies thinking this is, you know, super healthy. And they can be, some of them are healthier than others, but for instance, the berry smoothie has, it says it's 120 calories per serving, but that's in four ounces. Four ounces is like this much. That's four ounces, it's not very much. And that means the whole bottle is 240 calories. So any of those like Odawalas and Naked and all of those, the smoothie drinks, be really careful. Some of them have a lot of sugar. They have other additives. So just start reading the labels. Stick with clear drinks. It's the time of eggnog. It's the time of all kinds of, you know, spiced mulled wines. And some of those have a lot of calories in them. Anything creamy is going to have a lot of calories in it. Eggnog has on average like 360 calories per cup. Cup? 360 calories, so yeah, it's it's up there. It's very, very caloric. So I like clear, I like a clear drink. So I've got just, so I do like the Chardonnay 
and this is four ounces. Let me show you what four ounces looks like. Again, that's four ounces, just like that. So it's not much. Actually, this is, holy moly, I did a big pour on this one, didn't I? This is a little over four ounces. So like that, okay? Four ounces of wine. And then I do sparkling water and ice and a splash of unsweetened cranberry juice. And that is my festive little drink, my friends, and I will continue and I'll fill it on up with maybe that much sparkling water. So I've got a big glass and I can nurse it and it's really fun and festive and it's delicious. Mmm, I always like to do videos where I can drink. So clearish drinks, so your wine, your champagne, if you're gonna do a hard liquor, I like tequila, I like vodka, but mixed with, in a big, like in a highball with a lot of sparkling water. So tequila and soda, vodka soda, with a lime, maybe a splash, again, like a splash of cranberry. So the final thing I wanna show you is this little snack that's under 100 calories. This didn't really fit in any of the videos I was doing. So what it is, is it's my favorite um, food-like product. It's a cheese-like product, which is not good for you, but I don't care because it's delicious. It's Laughing Cow. Laughing Cow Creamy Light for 30 calories and then 16 gluten-free pretzel sticks. And look at what I'm gonna do. pine <laughs> like a porky pine but with pretzels and it's 100 calories otherwise I would eat the whole bag right so I portion out 16 of them and then I stick them in my little cheese and this whole thing right here is just under 100 calories it's like 90 calories okay guys that's it a little bit of a holiday survival guide and some diet tips for you clear drinks low calorie lots of ice lots of soda and when you need to have a pretzel pine for 100 calories. <laughs> All right, y'all, keep the questions and comments coming. And on Instagram, I am at the care and feeding of divas, so please give me a follow there. All right, y'all stay as glamorous as you can stand to be.